everyone. We're back with this week's Candid Cam Live. And we're talking to our dear friend, Matthew Koenig of Nodeware. Now, Matthew, what is the biggest mistake that MSP owners make when hiring salespeople? God, there are so many of them. You know, and again, I go back to the fact that I've consulted with tons of MSPs on this concept. And and the first thing is I hire them too soon. They're not ready for them. Yeah. You know, they don't have any process in place whatsoever, even for themselves. They have no leads. They have no marketing. And yet they expect by hiring a salesperson, you know, in 90 days, everything's going to be great. <laughs> and when it isn't, they fire them and they're unhappy. So yes. I think the first thing is hiring too soon. But the yes. second thing is not having the proper processes in place, right? As a salesperson, what is the target market you want them to go after? Do you have any leads coming in? Do you have any marketing going on? When you have a salesperson, do you have some way, shape, or form besides a spreadsheet, a CRM of some kind, where you can track their activity and make sure they're doing the right things? Are they saying the right things on the phone? Are they sending the right things in email? Should they be focused on a particular product because that's your niche? If you can't plan any of these things through, hiring a salesperson at that point in time is going to cost you a lot of money and yeah. waste your time. But the final thing they do is even if they have that down, I hear MSPs all the time going, well, I'm going to hire someone on straight commission. Or I'm going <laughs> to hire 45000 a year. But they're going to yeah. be able to make a lot. No. No, yeah. if you hire someone at straight commission, you're going to get someone that sells roofs for a living. Okay. Yeah. Those are the guys and gals that go do that. You want a professional salesperson, you're going to pay a decent amount for a professional salesperson. Stop trying to be cheap on the things that you need the most. You want to be cheap. Be cheap on the kind of sodas you put in the refrigerator, yeah. not on the sales personnel you hire. Yeah, no, I 100% agree. And actually, not to do a shameless plug for myself, but I'm actually teaching a session at Build It Live about navigating the different tools that you need to build a sales and marketing engine and how to navigate those because you need the tools. You oh, can't man. just bring in people without giving them the right tools, but there's so many out there right now. And oh, so yeah. what makes a good tool and which ones do you invest in today and which ones do you wait and what are those processes and so, they don't even have to be expensive that's what drives me crazy they do not <laughs> they just need to have a thousands no you don't nope you just gotta have a process and i'm all about process so yes. i look forward to chatting with you about that you should come to my session you can collaborate with me and i will see all of you at build it live from september 18th through the 20th we're going to be in orlando florida at that beautiful waldorf astoria and so please register today www.itbd.net slash live matthew and i are going to go talk sales and we hope you all love joining the conversation